Yo, what's going on guys? Streaming gameplay using your mobiles nowadays are very, very popular. So there are a lot of streamers out there actually trying to stream their gameplay using their mobile. In today's video, we are going to discuss about how you can actually screen capture your mobile gameplay into your Streamlabs and streams from your PC. For those of you who want to screen capture your mobile using wirelessly, stay with me. You won't want to miss this. There are a few methods that you can actually screen capture your mobile gameplay into Streamlabs OBS. For example, you can use capture card or even direct cable from your mobile into your PC. But for me, I'm gonna focus on wireless for today's topic. But if you use cable, of course, that is actually able to provide even more stable and high quality screen capture. So the first software that I recommend to use, which is free that is let's view but of course when it comes to free the video quality is not what you expected but do not worry because you're able to actually improve or make adjustment to the video quality so that you're able to produce better quality so first thing first just open up your google and just type in let's view and just go to this official website and you'll see download and just click download and just download whichever system that you're using so which i have download so let's open up and connect using your your mobile so now that i have my let's view open before that actually connect wirelessly using your mobile keep in mind that you have to connect to the same network and of course you have to have also a stable wi-fi network in order to screen capture your mobile gameplay with no lag and of course stable video quality so the phone i'm actually using right now is my iphone so just open up your iPhone and connect to Let's View and you'll see my iPhone actually connected to my Let's View. So how do you actually have to connect? Just very simple, just slide down and you'll see the screen mirror and you'll see Let's View PC. If you connect to the same network, it's actually gonna show up and screen mirror it. If you want to stop mirroring, just click stop mirroring, your screen capture will be over. So after you have done screen mirror, why do I say free? Because you'll see the HD. When you click on it, you'll see HD and half HD, which actually for pro version, if you do not want to pay you want to use it for free you can just go for sd but of course the video quality is not as good as hd but before connect your mobile to let's view just go to the upper right and you'll see the setting menu just click on it and just go to display so that you're able to set some of the display but most of it you have to pay for the pro version but for the free version is actually enough to use in order for you to stream your gameplay using your mobile because you're able to actually adjust your video quality in streamlabs so that you're able to produce the best streaming quality and makes it look like a pro so the next software that i would like to recommend that is towan just open up your google and just go to towan and you'll see towan just click on it and you'll see able to download from which version according to your pc system so after you have done download your towan just open up the software and you'll see something like this so just sign in to according to your email and just create your password and you receive a verification code to your email just type in the verification code in order to complete the sign up process so after you have done sign up your towan account go to the settings and just go to the device which is ios or the android whichever device that you're using so just set your video quality on which video quality that you would like to streams of course for the android and will be the same just play around with it but the one you have to pay for the privilege because why if you don't pay it's actually gonna show the watermark during your screen capture so i actually suggest that you just go for free version of the let's view and just try for it once you have done using it and you feel that you want to pay for towan and you actually can go for a try because when it comes to the towan privilege it actually just costs 9.99 usd for a year and the best part that is you can actually stream without watermark so once you have done screen mirror your mobile into your pc you'll see a window open up that actually the screen mirror of your mobile just let the window open and the next thing is how you're gonna add it into your stream labs so once you have done screen mirror your mobile into your pc the next thing which is we have to add it into your streamlabs obs so how to do it trust me it is just very simple just come to the add source button just add and you'll see game capture and window capture 
so you can actually use either one but i prefer window capture so that i have my ready added so just come to your window capture and click the settings icon and you're able to see let's view cast so whenever the window is open just leave it there and just go to the let's view cast and just click it and it's gonna appear into your stream lab and just click done so after done and you're able to see the mobile screen mirror actually shows up so you're able to stream your mobile gameplay using Streamlabs OBS and at the same time you're able to use all the effects or the overlays in Streamlabs so that is how you can actually add your screen mirror from your mobile into Streamlabs and streams using your PC but do remember if you would like to have a stable video quality and of course stable screen mirror the best is actually to use cable but cable is not for everyone like me that i prefer actually wirelessly so remember that if you want to have a stable video quality you can either use cable or you can actually adjust the filter in your stream labs which actually we have discussed from our previous video and you can give it a try if you found out this video is actually helpful for your mobile streaming gameplay do like this this video and of course subscribe to my channel and do not forget to comment below if you found out any other free screen mirror software that is actually good to use so that's all for today's video i'll see you all in the next video thanks for watching and peace